Good morning. We are here at Fox Valley Technical College where we are going to do a walkthrough this morning of the Health Simulation Center. Okay, we're going to uh, start by going over towards our simulation labs. Um, on the left over here is a small simulation lab, which is designed to represent a typical hospital emergency type room that could also pass as a standard uh, med surge room. It uh, has all functional components to it. The head wall works, um, actually dispenses gases and suction. And we have a variety of monitors up there to monitor the patient's vital signs and also the electronic medical records. We have a variety of different size rooms. This is one of our double size rooms that allows us to uh, bring in more students and to actually work on patients on a side-by-side on -side basis. Again, all of the um, apparatus behind the bed, the head walls, the monitors, the displays are all functional. We are currently in the process of uh, reconnecting all the simulators to a very sophisticated uh, AV system called Learning Space, which will allow us to monitor the uh, situation, monitor the students, and also record all the vital signs and all the treatments that were done to the patients. So we can use that in our very vital debriefing process, which is done after students go through a, a simulation. We're coming up onto the second floor here, and this floor has some of the medical assistant classrooms. And what we did is this area is a reception type area before you would go into the medical office suite. This area here is for a nurses station. So the medical assistants and the nurses that are working can um, collectively come together and discuss their patients. And this right here is going to be the clinical room for the medical assistant students. This is going to be our phlebotomy room where our students are going to be able to practice blood draws on each other as well as other lab procedures. It'll be used for our medical assistant students as well as our phlebotomy students. Okay, now we're up on the third floor and this space is designed for a therapy area. And we're going to be going into our occupational therapy room. We have this space designed so that the students can actually experience what it's like in an actual apartment or home setting. So we have a kitchen area, and we also have a bathroom area, and then that is going to be a living room area. So it's gonna resemble um, what it would be like in a client's home, so they can learn what it takes for the client to have adaptive equipment and adaptive things in, at their home. On this side, we have designed an ADA bathroom, so the students can have exposure to that with the shower, as well as the toilet and all the handrails, and then the very end over here is going to be a, a bedroom, a simulated bedroom. 